Several suspects have been charged and more are expected in the shooting that killed a man at the Mall of America. Since the incident late last week, the mall is also beefing up security. Sammy Salina shares the new information that we learned today. The shoppers who stepped inside the Mall of America today said something felt different. Since then, yeah, there's definitely more presence kind of on every level. And some security caught people off guard. Definitely made me do a double take, but I just, I guess I don't really know what I thought about it. Every shopper we spoke to says they noticed an increase in presence and definitely noticed armed mall security. Of course, it makes you feel uneasy, especially if they're like opening carrying firearms. For me, I feel great about it. I mean, I'd like to see more security around. The Mall of America said in a statement that this isn't anything new, that this was actually put in place before, and this is just in response to local and national crime trends. They also said there are additional security measures, including bag checks. According to new court documents released today, during a fight, suspects cornered 19-year-old John Tay Hudson, prevented him from escaping, and shot him dead. Five people have been arrested, three are now charged, and the state said in court today there are plans to still charge another person with second-degree murder. According to court documents, 18-year-old Tayshawn Adams Wright is also charged with second-degree murder. Cameras caught him holding a gun, running toward Hudson, and standing over him, taking a shooting stance, according to paperwork. It also said clothing blocks several camera views and only shows someone's hand on a gun and a muzzle flash. Adams Wright is expected in court tomorrow afternoon. The two other juveniles facing riot charges appeared today. Meanwhile, added measures continue to catch the eyes of shoppers. I feel safer knowing that there's more security protocols. Sammy Solina, CARE 11 News.